are back again live and in style. You're here with Sexy Jesse, and we are at Any Budget Cars, 2241 Aurora Road, Melbourne, Florida. We just got in all of our new inventory. Uh, it was delivered, so I can give you guys the rundown of everything we got. We got, uh, you guys, oh no, this is a new one. Look at that. This is a uh, Ford Focus. I believe it's a 2006. Pretty, 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 pretty car. Uh, SEL model, which I imagine means super uh, extra, extra, extra leathery, extra, extra nice. And let's see the inside of this thing. Woo, man, this thing is nice inside. Look at this thing. Woo, whoever said we have shitty cars? Well, maybe we did before, but that looks really good to me now. Let's see the back seat. Oh, and it's still black leather. Uh, can you guys see all this? You see everything in there? Woo, man, this thing's nice. Ah, sorry, I just had a, uh, an allergy thing. My freaking nose is going. Uh, if you guys stay tuned, too, we're going to do something really fun with one of those $500 cars uh, in just a second. They're pulling it around, so we're going to have a little fun there. Uh, but in the meantime, I'm going to show you guys some of these other cars here. Uh, this is the red Ford. Uh, I think this is the, that was the Fusion. This is the Focus. So this is the 2008 Ford Focus. This thing is also super nice. Oh my God, look how nice this thing is. Nice and clean, pretty red too, like a bull. Get some Chevy 4x4s. Man, I wish I could. I uh, had a Ford 4x4. Uh, we got a black Ford FX4. Uh, yes, got delivered today, sold today already. So the four wheel drives go quick, man. Uh, I think that's the only four wheel drive we got left. I don't know if this Tahoe, we got a Tahoe over here. It's, I don't know if it's four wheel drive. Let's check her out. But can you guys see that one? That's a uh, that's a new one as well. It's a 2003. Uh, is it a? It doesn't say four wheel drive on the back or inside. Let's check the inside. See if we got the uh, little four wheel drive handle. Mr. Newman, guess what, Mr. Newman? We got your fucking car. Oh, we got it in the back, bro. I'll take you around to see it. Oh, this thing's fucking nice inside. Holy shit. I mean, it's got some duct tape on the seat right here. But you all know duct tape fix anything. It is not. Yes, sir. You're right. It is not. But it is nice inside, actually. So uh, seats actually fold down. As you guys can see, it's nice and leather inside. All the leather looks good except for where the fuck. Drop the phone. Yeah, I know there's a problem. All the leather looks nice except for where somebody's fat butt was sitting. They must have ripped it a little bit. Maybe they had some heavy legs, but it's all right. That's all right. Duct tape fix everything. Here we go. Exactly. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. We got this white F-150 right here. Let's see, this one is not four wheel drive, but it is long bed and it is locked. That is not usually the case. We got a two of these Buicks. Both of them are 2004s. AC work in the Tahoe, rain check. Rain check, I'm not sure. It should, it should, but uh, I'm not sure. If it's not, then we'll get that, we'll get that working because we can't really sell cars without AC. So, I mean, we'll end up getting it fixed, man. Uh, this is a, both of them blue Buick rendezvous. So both are 2004s. We got the silver one or gray, whatever color you want to call it. And then we got a black one here. Uh, both of those are really nice as well. And we got a Mercury Mariner. The guy that bought the Mercury Mariner came back in and bought the black F-150 four-wheel drive uh, and traded this one back into us. So uh, then we have a Dodge Dakota Sport model here. We still got freaking dealer plate slacking like that what the heck these guys are slacking off i gotta throw this thing back up here Woo! oh look at this guy what do we got over here guys hang on wait a second this is a 500 hundred dollar car but wait a second watch what it does <laughs> 500 dollar infinity man look at this thing Bucks. Too Look at that. 500 bucks? It's worth the $500 just to do burnouts. That little affinity. Oh my goodness. That's a 1995, too, I think. God, that was nice. That was pretty. That was pretty awesome. Anybody that missed it, go back and rewatch it, like and share it, because how many people you've seen do a 1995 Infinity J30 do a burnout like that? You would have thought you'd seen that in this Mustang here. But. The Mustang is still here. I don't know why. I don't know where my Ford Mustang people are, but that's all right. Then we got the Altima here. We still got the Honda Accord. This one's been on the lot, I think, the longest. The blue Honda Accord with like 120,000 miles on it. We got this new one in. Cavaliers, a little Chevy there action. Those ones are usually pretty nice cars. They're solid cars. Only got 100,000 miles on it. 
<laughs> I don't even know where he's going with that thing now. Let's see what else we got. We got the Nissan Frontier still here. Actually, we don't know if it's a transmission or maybe just the engine's a little bit, got low power or something like that. Uh, still got this daggone minivan. No matter how many people I draw on the back of it, look at this. No matter how many of y'all, how many people I draw on the back of this thing, nobody can just envision themselves in the minivan. Uh, we did get this one in on a trade. I think it's a 2008 Saturn something or another. Uh, well, I think it's got the little back thing here, so whatever that means. Uh, shit, and it, oh, an Astra. Uh, we did get, oh, and here comes the uh, Infinity. It's probably gonna do some crazy shit now. Uh oh, look at it, look at that thing go. It's got power, man, 500 bucks. That's only 500 bucks. Uh, we got this guy here, Ford Taurus just came in. It's pretty, pretty, pretty car. Uh, we got this, it's, I, it's purple. It looks black. It says purple on the title, but uh, it looks black, so I don't really know. I guess it looks kind of maroonish in the light now, but let's see here. We go back, and look at this. This is my truck right here. I've had this truck since I was 17. It's the F-150, and what I tell you, duct tape fixed everything. I've had this duct tape on there since 2009. 2009. Now, I've had to redo it a couple times over the old duct tape. But I did that when I was going to my apartment complex, backing up. I hit the little doggone pin pad thing, popped right off, duct taped that bitch back together, boom, perfect. So duct tape fixed, fixes uh, Chevy Tahoe seats and F-150s. And look at what we got back here in the back. This is for Mr. Uh, Mr. Sam here. Look at this thing. Look at this E-250. Look at this guy. Well, it's for Sam or whoever comes first. Sam, Sam's got a priority here. He's got dibs, I think. But look at this guy. Let's, let's see inside this bad boy. Ooh, looks like a nice van. Got a prison cage in the back, or don't mess with my tools cage. Who even knows what's going on with this thing? Uh, it's got the place to put your ladders up top. If you guys are probably looking in the sun, I apologize. Didn't need your welder's glasses. And we got the back here with all the tool shed stuff, shelves, racks, doing all the stuff that you do when you're working on stuff. Doing your thing. I see an A-Team van build. That's what I'm talking about. A-Team, exactly. I see an awesome van. And that is what we got in today, guys. Uh, that was the uh, a peak of the 11 cars we got. Um, that was a little $500 burnout special. Uh, so you guys can take a look at that one. If you guys wanna come in and do some burnouts in that thing, any Jeep four-wheel drive or two. Uh, I got a Jeep with a four-wheel drive in the back that I can't get working um i'll show it to you real quick that one's up to you if you want to come and take a look at it uh, i think other than otherwise i don't know if i have another jeep i don't even know what the hell this thing is we got it looks like we got a red s10 here too i don't know what the hell that is uh that just came showed up but uh here's the white jeep i believe it is four wheel drive uh it's a i think it's a 1999 let me check the vin on that thing <sighs> not uh 98 my bad so it's a 1998. Uh, it is, I believe, four-wheel drive in this thing. I, was, well, I think I was told this was. It's a Jeep Cherokee. Uh, my hair is in my face. Uh, let's see here. That is that. I think that's all the ones we got in. We have a. Oh shit! No, we got a Nissan Altima here too. Holy crap! I guess we. I guess we got a white Nissan Altima as well, guys. So that's that one right there. This is the little burnout baby. Little burnout baby. You guys want to come out and do some burnouts in this thing? You know it'll do it. Roast the tires. Still got a lot of tread left on these things too. So those are almost like they were brand new tires. Look at that. So that's where we are right now, guys. That's all the cars. That's what we got going on. Uh, if you like this, like and share this video. If you guys had some fun watching it, watching the little burnout in the $500 car. Uh, if you do like everything we're doing here, stop on in, say hi to us, or uh, stop on in and buy a car from us either way. Yeah, we'll be happy with either one of those. So uh, we are at uh, 2241 Aurora Road, Melbourne, Florida, 32935. Our phone number is 321-425-6313. You can check us out at anybudgetcars.com or on Facebook and I think Instagram at anybudgetcars.com. Well, not .com on those ones, but the little asterisk A thingamabop, A with the swirly, anybudgetcars on both of those. All right, guys, remember, like and share, take it easy.